Uh-uh, you haven't been. And if you have been, it's time to step it up regardless, okay? It's time to step it the fuck up. Look, if you haven't been doing well, right, what the fuck ever, okay? Whatever. If you feel like you failed, are you going to give up? Is that what you're going to do? If you're going to give up, then don't talk to me, okay? Because I don't talk to people that give up on themselves, all right? All of us are going to get knocked down. We're going to get knocked down on our ass. We're going to get knocked down on our face. We're going to fall fucking belly flop, back flop. And sometimes you're going to go unconscious. That's how hard you're going to fall, okay? But it's not even about that. That's what life throws at you. That's all good, right? That builds character. That builds, that's where you can be like, look, this is what I've been through in my life, right? So that's all good, right? But it's how do you get up? How the fuck do you get up, right? And do you get up fast or do you take your time and do you fucking think that, you know, life is against you and all of that bullshit, right? Or do you get up and then you get even stronger, right? It's like now you have fucking wings behind you because of what just happened, right? So it's not a matter of you falling down. It's like, okay, let's fucking go, right? And now it's a matter of taking it to the next level, stepping it up. You know what the fucking problem is? You know what the fucking problem is? Is you have people around you that don't have goals, that aren't driven, that are settling, that think their life is fucking fine and they're okay living this stupid, mediocre, bullshit, boring, fucking, just non-eventful life, right? That's not what we're about, okay? And I just can't stand. Sometimes I see it. Sometimes I'll, you know, I'll go for a run or I'll go for a workout and then I'll notice. I'm like, ah, oh, shit. I got their dirty shit on me right now. Fucking A, let's, let's move. Then I fucking run. I run my fucking heart out so that I can wake the fuck up out of that lull of life, okay? You don't wanna be in the lull of life. Like, oh, well, you know, like, just making it through, just making it through. Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit, okay? You know what I've been seeing recently on like a side note that I'm really just fucking digging and do it more is our IMC students, right? Our girls, the ones who are watching this. Your selfies, you're looking good, and we're inspiring that shit around the world, okay? That's the way to do it. Fucking be beautiful. Be proud of how your body looks of your life, right? Let's go. Let's go. It's time to take it to the next level. You're worried if you're going to stay on your nutrition plan or not? Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? That is so basic. That is basic shit. You got to get your body right so that you can do what you need to do. Let that be a goal that you are done with already, right? And then you maintain. Every day I work out, but now my workout is not to make my body look good. It already fucking looks good, right? It's to make my body look great. It's to get myself in the right state of mind. It's so that I can just kind of get in tune, get in line with who I am, what I'm about. You know what I mean? Like, let's go already. It's time to step it the fuck up in all of the areas of your your life. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Are you going to live your whole entire life and look back on it and be like, man, I wish I would have went harder. Uh, uh, no, it's time to fucking live fucking hard. That is so inappropriate. Okay. But super appropriate. So it's time to live fucking hard. Like let's fucking go wake the fuck up and let's live hard. Yeah eat right. Yeah. Work out. Yeah. Give it everything you've got. Okay. Everything you've got. You only know, you only know how, 
how you can really like look or feel or accomplish something when you give it everything you have. You don't know until you've done that, right? So I have a five week boot camp program, right? And you see these incredible results. One of the reasons is, is I'm like, look, you have five weeks. If you can't dedicate yourself for five weeks, then stop fucking doing this goal. That's it. That's it. Fucking give up, right? Fucking dedicate yourself. Jesus. It's not that hard. It's to yourself. You act like it's to something else. This is for yourself. This life is for you. Your fitness is for you. Your nutrition is for you. Your job is for you, right? Fuck, fuck. I don't even know what I said right now. I don't know even if it fucking inspired you or motivated you or if it just yelled at you for five minutes. I don't fucking know. But look, look, we're here. We got a short amount of time here. That's something Arash always reminds me of, you know? And he's like, live fucking hard. That's one of the things that I admired about him. When I first met him, he had this energy about him, right? I was 18 years old. He was 29. And I was like, who the fuck is he? He's, whoa, he's alive. No one else is alive. He is fucking alive right now. I want that shit. I want that shit. But you have to you have to work for that shit, okay? It is so easy to just kind of fall asleep into this life, okay? But you have to wake up. You got to wake up. You got to put goals here. You got to bring life to them, okay? You got to bring life to your day right the fuck now, okay? Everyone else is sleeping. Don't fucking sleep through this life. Don't fucking sleep through this life, okay? Don't fucking sleep through this life. Let's go. It's time to fucking wake up. It's time to make it happen, all right? Set some goals for the week, okay? Really, set some goals. I'm going to make this amount of money. I'm going to hit this goal when it comes to my body. I'm going to work out every single day. I'm going to communicate more than I ever have. I'm going to post more selfies, okay? I'm going to make my relationships better in life. Because of me, the people around me are going to do better. They're going to be happier, okay? Okay? This is the way to do it. I look around me and everyone's fucking sleeping, okay? Not us, all right? It's time to move. Let's go. Like Arash D. Bazaar always says, be the best and fuck the rest. This is IMC Nation. Let's kill it.